Hello there, here we are in the uh, beautiful region of Puglia. We are of course in southern Italy today and we are 10 minutes away, well not even, more seven minutes away from Ostuni, the beautiful town of Ostuni. Again, it's really sought after location. And this being so close, today I'm showing you a two bedroom property, super cute. It's a Trullo Saraceno, so those are the Trulli that don't have the tall cones, but are equally as old. And this one has been beautifully restored. Uh, so we've got these electric gates. Let's uh, walk through and I'll start by showing you the property from the outside as well as the garden area and surrounding land. So show them the property. It's an L-shaped Trullo Saraceno and uh, you can see you've got the barrel vaulted ceilings. That is the bedroom area. Uh, so again, you've got two bedrooms here. Uh, and we've got 90 square meters of property. Now this is an area where a pool could be added on. It doesn't currently have it, but I would definitely recommend putting in a pool here because it's kind of the perfect uh, place to have a swimming pool and that would allow you to rent it out much better. Um, but you can see, let's show you the garden area. We've got this little, uh, very cute pergola here. Uh, with the growing plants over it, that creating that natural shade. I love this and it's very fitting with the type of property that we're looking at. If you come through here, we can see the rest of the land. So here we have 3000 square meters of land and basically it's where you can see the grass has been cut. So there is no fence at the end, but it borders with another property further down. So eventually you could do a little fence that goes along, but just to show them the exact line it's where the grass has been cut i think this would be your ideal location for a swimming pool maybe get a bush like this growing further down it would really open up the house and make the house feel a lot more spacious because 3,000 square meters of garden it's a good amount without being too much if you ask me again we're seven minutes from ostuni so it doesn't take anything to get here and it would really work ideally as a holiday home as well so uh, let's go inside and let me start showing you this beautiful trullo you can see how they've exposed all the stone in here and uh, you can see just how cutely it's been done. So there's lots of features here. You can see from the, this is all the old, old features have been kept. It's also a property that has heating in it. So we've got a gas tank here and that is connected to the radiators in this property. So it's a property which potentially could be lived in all year round. Again, 90 square meters of property here. Uh, I love all these little cute features here. Now you can see, this is one of the cutest kitchens I've come across lately. Uh, it's actually in a little bit of a cone here. Uh, and you can see just how cleverly and how well they've done the small kitchen here, right? And if you keep in mind, most of this property will be used in the summertime. You're gonna be mainly eating outside, but it's nice to see that they've even managed to get an oven in there, as well as all the hobs. Now here they have this really good size corridor going through and again you've got the exposed stone and we, I really like the feel of this place. It's like as much as it's 90 square meters it feels bigger uh, just because of how cleverly they've been done with the, with the layout of the property. So here we have the bedroom, barrel vaulted ceiling, very tall ceiling as well, like it doesn't feel cramped in here at all. You've got a really nice window here and then you've got the ensuite bathroom in here. So it's kind of, this one doesn't have a shower in it, but it does have all your essentials. It even includes a, a day in here. So maybe if you didn't want that, potentially that could be changed and a, and a shower could be introduced. 
Here we have the second bathroom, which is much larger than the first. Obviously, this one does include a shower. And again, the barrel vaulted ceilings, I think, are a nice addition. And this here is finally the master bedroom. Uh, the beautiful thing about this, it's a really good size room. You've got, because we're on the L shape, you've got views onto the front patio. Uh, and I think this property, it's a very cute package. What's already here is already very nicely done. I think with a few additions, especially to the outside, because I think the outside with that bush in the front, and maybe we'll go out to the front to finish off outside and just showing you as we walk back. I think maybe the garden outside, I would push that bush further back so that you could open this up and it not feel like this is the only era because having all that land behind, I think it's, it's a waste uh, of space and I think you know this could be done much nicer. Uh, but again, look at the beautiful outside. All the outside has been exposed. I think that's an absolutely uh, beautiful feature that they've had between outside and inside. You can see the stone all around. The wonderful thing about this property is they have all the paperwork in order. So it's also quite a quick property if you did decide to come and, and uh, you wanted to purchase it, it's actually gonna be one of the faster ones that move. And again, potentially do that pull. I think this property is gonna be a great holiday home and, and a really good sound investment for someone looking to get in on the Yastuni hype uh, now that it's you know peak time for it. So um, if you have any more questions on this property or any of the others, please don't hesitate to get in touch. Thank you very much for watching.